Hi everyone, today's headlines. Center releases Rs 111.20 crore to Nagaland under Jal Jeevan mission. Tunsang police launch feedback box for people to register their complaints. Nagaland records 18 deaths and 276 COVID positive cases on May 25th. Online workshop held on spring shed management. Department of Animal Husbandry and Veterinary Services promotes backyard poultry farming. Power supply to be disrupted temporarily in Mon District. News in details. Sender releases Rs 111.20 crore to Nagaland under Jal Jeevan mission. The central government has allocated Rs 444.81 crore to Nagaland state under Jal Jeevan mission for the year 2021-22 of which Rs 111.20 crore was released on Tuesday. Along with other Northeast state, Ministry of Jal Shakti informed on Tuesday. The Government of India released Rs 1,605 crore to eight northeastern states for the implementation of Jal Jeevan Mission to provide tap water system to rural homes in the financial year 2021-22, Info Ministry of Jal Shakti. Central Government has allocated a total of Rs 9,262 crore as central grant for Northeast State under Jal Jeevan Mission during financial year 2021-22. First tranche of Rs 1,605 crore has been released to 8 Northeast State, it informed. Twinsang police launched feedback box for people to register their complaints. The Twinsang police came up with an innovative solution feedback box to overcome the challenges faced by the citizens in registering their complaint due to prevailing COVID-19 situation. During this pandemic time, people are finding very difficult to register their complaints and share their problem with police. Thus, crimes like domestic violence, theft, etc. are going unreported, Twinsang police said. To address this problem, DEF Tunseng has come up with an innovative of feedback or complaint or suggestion box. Citizens can now drop their complaint, suggestion, feedback or whatever they want to share with the police to these feedback boxes, Tunseng police informed. The Superintendent of Police, Tunseng Amit Nigam IPS, launched this new initiative, Feedback Box for the People. This will be directly monitored by the SP office, Tunseng on daily basis and prompt action will be taken, informed Tunseng Police. Nagaland records 18 deaths and 276 COVID positive cases on May 25th. Nagaland reported 276 COVID positive cases and 18 deaths due to COVID-19 and 161 recoveries on Tuesday, May 25th, 2021, updated the Health Minister S. Pangi form. With 276 new positive cases on Tuesday, the total tally of positive cases rose to 20,535 and active cases stands at 4,806, the Health Minister updated. The state also reported 18 deaths due to COVID-19 on Tuesday, taking the death toll to 303. Out of 18 deaths yesterday, 12 deaths were from Dimapur and 3 each from Koima and Mogajo. Online workshop held on Springshed Management. People Science Institute and Department of Land Resources, Nagaland hosted an online experience sharing stockholders consultation workshop on Springshed Management for the state of Nagaland on May 25, 2021. PSI Anida Sharma chairing the online workshop said that the main objective of the online workshop was to emphasize the experience and challenges faced by the various departments and agencies working on the watershed management in Nagaland and to formulate strategy to address the challenges and taking the spring shed program in a mission mode at the state level in collaboration with various stockholders. Department of Animal Husbandry and Veterinary Services promotes backyard poultry farming. With a view to mitigate food security during the pandemic period, the Department of Animal Husbandry and Veterinary Services through NEC project has initiated promotion of backyard poultry farming in the state. A DIPR report said that fast-growing birds are being reared in the department farm to cater the demand of poultry rearers which will be available for sale in face manner starting with Koima and Dimapur scheduled on May 31, 2021. Power supply to be disrupted temporarily in Mon district. The Deputy Commissioner of Mon, Tavasilian KIS, issued a circular informing that the power supply to Mon district headquarters and surrounding areas would be disrupted from 7 a.m. to 10 a.m. and 2.30 p.m. and 5 p.m. daily. This is in view of the intensive jungle clearance work along 66 kV Nagri Mora Dizit transmission line from May 24, 2021 to June 5, 2021 by the Department of Power, the DC informed. 
It is to be noted that the works are critical in order to ensure stable power supply to Mon district before the onset of monsoon, and the DC requested the affected customers to kindly bear with the inconvenience. That's all for now. To guess this latest news, don't forget to subscribe this channel. Thank you.